morality is based on the everyday phenomenal of compassion without any alternative motive. Therefore, the compassionate person is not egocentric. Because the compassionate person, how use empathy, feel himself like the suffering person in question. There is no barrier between him or her and the sufferer. He placed himself in the position of the sufferer. And therefore, with a little bit of imagination, knows how the suffering feels. This is called empathy. You know how the others feel, or you can imagine how the others feel. You don't be apathetic. You look things from a decent perception. A position which if anybody have this position will create peace and justice, true justice. True ecology, civilized culture. This is what we do, the vegans. We are place ourselves in the positions of the suffering persons, animals, victims. We place ourselves in the position of the victims. It stands that we use the position of the victimizer, like the people do how eat meat dairy and eggs, and make excuses for cruel and psychotic festivals, like pig fest in Sydney or Yuan festivals. You first, upon you are. The blood is on your hands. That something is a tradition, it does not make it okay. Slavery was once a tradition. You know? White dominance was a tradition in the West. You know? It was a tradition. Or, or it was a custom for whites in America to savagely sodomize oh, slaves. How are don't uh, do what the slave master wants to do in front of his family, on the front of the family of the slave, to totally humiliate them and bring fear in them. So they don't try to escape. If you are not a victim, don't imagine it entirely from your point of view. Because if you are not a victim, then you can easily justify it. most any cruelty. Like Hammond, slave master, governor of the south, Ancient uh, 18th century once have proved in many of his letters on slavery, his letters in defense of student slavery. When he was so arrogant to say, the abolitionists. Reasoning in the abstract, if it were some moral or political question or a minor question in politics, in their arrogance and selfishness, they completely forget our feelings and positions. Now, again, when you use empathy, which comes from compassion, and you use it to place yourself in the position of the suffering person or animal in question, 
then you see that my signs like that are selfish, self-righteous, arrogant and come from malice and ego. Malice or ego. They are not coming from compassion. They are coming from pure malice. Psychopathy. Psycho. Pets. Narcissists and other scum. When you are the victim, things look a lot different from that angle. When you are the slaves in 19th century or 19th century America, and you are where seen like property, or when you are a pig in a factory farm. which is even worse in most cases. Pay place in a metal crib where you not can move. Artificial is seminated any year when you're a cow and then your child is taken away and killed nearly on the same moment or after four to five months if they are raised for veal if they are a male the females get the same disgusting life as their mothers they are become artificial inseminated which is an euphemism for rape and then they are going to replace their mothers where their mothers are die because that their um, body stop working good because there are so much inseminated any all any year two times so that their their industry gets constant flow of milk this is disgusting this is an abomination and it must stop and if you have a hard time to understand this fact this will probably because you are have nothing been victim of anything and you are being raised like a pretty overprivileged king and queen in the first world matrix you don't understand who it feels to be treated like nothing, like your life don't matter at all, like you are a thing, an object, a tool. But it's not so hard to understand if you are a nice, compassionate, warm hearted people, person. Being. If you are a true human being, instead of a disgusting, hominid, manipulative virus. Compassion to all living beings is a mark of a civilized society. Horse fighting, cock fighting, rodeos and zoos. Racism, sexism, and speciesism, heterosexism, misogyny, bestiality, festivals like Pig Fest, Yuan Festival, and Isolation uh, Murder Festival of Wheels and others. CLC, uh, say the CLs, are all signs of an uncivilized cult. It is time to be fat, lazy, slobby, and stop judging anybody. I say, and stop judging anybody of the be wrong but yourself. Look in the mirror, like my channel's name, the mirror of the truth. I am in front of your face. 
I don't give you good things for your bad habits, particularly not on this channel. Now, I give you things you must know, spectacular if you are claiming that you are a moral and decent person. Go vegan. What's the execution causing the least amount of harm possible on this planet? If beans, lentils, legumes, tofu, seitan, uh, bananas, khaki fruits, mangoes, pineapples, eggplants, and many other stuff like rice, potatoes, and pasta, noodles. Most noodles are vegan. There are made uh, uh, from rice or from corn or from wheat. Just like most pastas are plant-based, pure plant-based, hundred percent plant-based, without any drop of animal body parts or secretions. We only have defiled some of their products because we have an overproduction of animal body parts and fluid fetishists. And there is an uh, extraordinary demand for products like this. But traditional noodles, traditional Pastas are most of the time plant-based, pure plant-based. Don't there's not animal products in them most of the time. You don't need eggs to make bread or eggs to make cakes. You can use bananas and tofu. And many other things to get the same result. Um, if you want to make a video uh, where I talk about my favorite uh, alternatives uh, to use in cakes or pies, where you can replace that uh, ham period with. Put it in the description. I uh, put it in the comment section, and then one, I will make a video of it. For now, Grima type out. When darkness and light become one, the reality is split in a way, and truth become visible.